Archaeologist Zhao Zilao believes he has found what may be one of the first examples of Neanderthal art. A painted shell from 37,000 years ago. You can see on this side a pigment, which you can see there so that and there. So that's pigment, is it? This is a paste combining a yellow and, and red to make a homogeneous orange. So in order to thing. achieve that, you would have had to have taken raw red, raw yellow, mix them together and then apply it. That's it. Zhao thinks the hole in the middle means it could have been used as a pendant. But why would Neanderthal hunter-gatherers start wearing symbols like this? If you only meet people whom you know, um, you don't even have to have names for them. You, you know who they are, you know? But if, if, you, if all of a sudden you start getting uh, to deal with strangers on a frequent basis, people who don't speak your language, that's where these codes, these symbols uh, kick in. So do you think this suggests that Neanderthals were essentially the same as us culturally and in their way of thinking? Definitely Neanderthals uh, and their modern human contemporaries were much more alike than, than, than we have uh, uh, so far thought. The idea that Neanderthals had jewellery is contentious. But in 2011, Zhao made a similar discovery at a prehistoric modern human site he's excavating nearby, and it raised an even more controversial possibility. Oh, that's lovely. And it was found here at this site. Fantastic, what a lovely find. Found it. Yeah. The similarities of this modern human ornament compared with the Neanderthal one go way beyond its natural appearance. The shell is naturally red, Yeah. but on top of that natural red, you can see there, there, and here between the ribs. This is the remains of painting, you can see very well in the microscope. Mm -hmm. And this comes from an, an early modern human level, dated to about 30,000 years ago. In fact, there's no evidence of modern humans in this area before 30,000 years ago. But the Neanderthal ornament is older than that, by 7,000 years. This raises the intriguing possibility that when modern humans arrived here, they could have been copying Neanderthals. <laughs>